Let us learn how to write standard equation of a circle given center and the radius. So this is the first example. C or the center, the coordinate of the center is at 3, 1 and radius is 2 units. So if you are given the center and so with the radius, you are going to simply plug that into your standard form of the equation of the circle or the standard equation of the circle which is x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equal to r squared. So take note your center it should be hk. I mean this is our uh, center coordinate the h and the k so your x value is on h so this is now x minus 3 squared plus y. Your k there is the y value on the coordinate of the center. So you have y minus 1 raised to the power of 2. That will be equal to r squared. You've got there the radius, which is 2. So you will have to plug that in and then square it. Then we are going to simplify this one. So we've got x minus 3 squared plus y minus 1 squared and that's equal to 4. So this is now our standard equation of the circle. Let us now go to another example. So if you want to you can pause the video and then resume that one once you've got the standard form of or the standard equation of the circle. So let's have this one here. So again We've got x minus h raised to the power of 2 plus y minus k raised to the power of 2 equal to r squared. So then again, we plug in. This is our h. This is our k. So this is now x minus our h is negative 2, raising that 1 to the power of 2 plus y minus our k is negative 4 raising that 1 to the power of 2 and that's equal to r here is 5 thirds we raise that 1 to the power of 2 simplifying this one this is negative and negative so that would lead to a positive 2 raised to the power of 2 plus negative negative again that would lead to a positive so we have y plus 4 raised to the power of 2 this one is a fraction squared we are going to distribute our power to each of the position here. So this is 5 squared over 3 squared. Simplifying this part here, so we've got x plus 2 squared plus y plus 4 squared. And that's equal to 25 over 9. So since this cannot be reduced, then that will be our final standard equation of our circle. So let us now go for another example. So again, you may pause the video and then resume that one once you've got the standard equation of your circle. So here we've got C center as 5, 6 and radius as 2, 5. Then we are going to do X minus H squared plus Y minus K squared. And that will be equal to R squared. Our X, we copy that one. Our h there is 5 and our k is 6. So x minus 5 squared plus y mi minus 6 squared. That will be equal to r is 2 fifth. So we are going to raise that 1 to the power of 2. Reducing this or simplifying this part here on the right side. So x minus 5 squared plus y minus 6 squared. That will be equal to 4. Again, we are going to distribute this one here on each position. So this will be 2 squared over 5 squared. Simplifying that one, x minus 5 squared plus y minus 6 squared. And that will be equal to 4 over 25. We cannot reduce this one. So this will be our final answer for the standard equation of the circle. So I think that's it. So I hope you were able to learn something from me today and 
Good luck in every challenges in your life. Please take a look at the brighter side. Everything will pass through.